So after we already load the ink to the ink damper, then we can start to do the cleaning from the software. So we open the software, and uh, here we can see the cleaning. So before we do the operation, let me introduce the software function for each for you. So when we open the control software, after the installation, we can see this the interface of the core control software. And here is the online offline symbol. If it's become glowing, that means connected. And also you need to connect the, the internet cable between the printer and computer by the internet cable. So when you power on the machine and connect the cable, the icon will be light on. And this icon is for flash. So when you open the flash here, when you open it, the, the light will be green. And here is the temperature for the print head. So we can go to voltage and see here, if, if here can show the green light and can detect the temperature of the print head, that means the two print head is installed where, without any problem. And here is X position, is for the carriage position. Then we go here, it shows device ready. And that means the machine is power on succeeds. And the green light means no error. This is the error message. Or the lock file. Then we go to the top. So first is the file. The file is used for open the open the print file we want to print. We can put the file on desktop or we open the file from here. And here is for print. This is the print job list. This is the history job list of the print. And here is for setting. Here is for head select. If you have two print heads, so just select color and white. And this is for print speed, high speed or middle speed, and the battle action or unit action. So if you did a good alignment for the battle action, you can print it with under battle action. But if you cannot make a good alignment for the battle action, so it's better to use the to left or to right. And then it's the pre-print flush. We can choose off. And all cleaning we can close here or keep as default. And it is the color bar. The color bar we can open it by by waiting and the status, or just uh, keep status, keep w waiting. If we open this, then they also have a line print at the left or right side at any position of the, um, for print to prevent the print head clock. You can choose the position at the left or at the right for the color bar. And let's keep it default. It's a size, the color bar size for the width, for distance beside the edge of the picture. In collision, we can choose deep and fog for better quality. This for load ink, two heads, we can choose head one, head two. This only used for the first time you, you load ink from the software, load ink from the print head, from damper to the print head. Normally we just use cleaning because if you choose load ink, it, if it's power cleaning, it will cost lots of ink. And this is for print model. You can choose print white or print color. Or normal print means print white and color one pass print together and the mineral print, we can choose no mineral or mineral as we want. And this is for keep as default. So this is all the setting. And this is the adjustment, this is the alignment, alignment for the print head. Later, must we will show you uh, step by step. This the voltage is for the voltage of the print head from here. So if here show the temperature, that means print head install where. Otherwise to here, 
and this is for the the the, the Lord you can press the password for six number with one digital number with one to go to the engineer setting for check some setting but normally we don't need to go this setting this is the version information for the the version information for the member this firm, firmware version for member the carriage board so this is rip we keep default and this is for also for some uh, engineer using so we just keep default <clears throat> then we go to the setting we can also see here this uh, margin setting x margin the x margin means the edge the distance the distance between the edge of the with the film so we all normally we put the film at the middle of the table and we keep the edge zero at this side so this almost the zero so if you want to print the picture from here you small reduce the edge the x margin if you want to put it on the middle so you just increase the x margin parameter so the x margin is used for the x start position for the x axis So after we know all the function for the control software, and also when we go to the the red top here has a load and a save. So when the first time to open the control software, you need to click load to load the parameter to the software. And each setting, if you set, for example, this one, we set the for waiting, and we must click save. So just remember, each setting you change you must place save from the control software to save the parameter to the main board please remember you we must click save and the first time you power on the machine and the control software you must click load to load the parameter to the software so this is the process so after we know the each function for the control software and also here have the some setting from here. So his, here is for open open file for print. As we said, we can also check the file, open the file from here. And here is for print and pause and cancel the job. This is for another check to check the head status, the head is clocked or not. This is for cleaning. To clean the print head, we can choose two head for weak, normal, or strong, or we choose head one or head two cleaning. And this is for flush. The flush means the print, if you open the flush, the print head will flush a little bit of ink, a little bit of ink to flush on the, the cap station to keep weight to prevent the head clock. So the flush is almost used for you go out for dinner for two, one or two hours for using. If you long time not use the machine, you need to click off and for keep wait. As the tutorial video later, the margin is used for you move the carriage out. So normally we not need to set the margin from here. We just we set the margin from from setting from here the margin. So also you, you can set the margin as this. For example, I want the car I want to print start print from here. So we can move the carriage out. You can place left. The carriage will move out. And for example, I want print from here. Then move the carriage to here and then I place margin. Then it will show you whether to correct position is X margin. Click OK. Then the carriage back to home position. So this is the X margin position for setting. But normally we just we go to uh, we go to an adjuster to put the we go to setting put the margin from here. It's more convenient. And then it's for left. It's move the carriage to left. When we place left, then the carriage will move to left. And right is for control the carriage move to right. And 
here is ahead is for move the film to front and back as for control the film to back side and the X reset is for move the cage back to home position when we place X reset then the cage will back to home position and go to keep weight or flash if you open the flash then we go to flash then here is the spot channel setting we click on we go to it we can see they have some uh, setting for spot one and spot two so normally we just keep it as default we can also keep as enable for spot one and we can go to choose rip and here is for for anti overlap for white ink you can put 0.1 for each left right top and bottom which is here which is if you have only have one two print head one for white one for color so you just need to set support one to click on enable and ink amount you can also choose 100% and we choose rip if you did the spot channel from rip so you can set rip and here is the blotting, the blotting setting for, for cut down the edge of the white ink layer to prevent the white ink print overlap. So here we can set zero or we also can set from the RIP, so RIP software to cut down the edge to prevent the, head, the, the white ink layer overlap. This number cannot too big. If you print a picture with some small words, characters, it's better to reduce the amount to 0 0.1 or 0 0.089 as this. So this is spot channel setting. So this is the, all the explanation for the Nebula 62F DTF printer, the control software.